The world's most prolific artist, Thomas Kincaid, died unexpectedly last night at his home near San Francisco. Kincaid sold more works of art than anyone else, popular beyond measure, even if his critics weren't always impressed. Thomas Kincaid knew his way around a canvas cottage. His paintbrush traced millions of lighthouses and churches and quaint downtowns. He was part Walt Disney, part Norman Rockwell. At least, that's how he saw his work. And whether you thought he was a talented painter or not, most agree, he was a marketing genius. His paintings hang in an estimated one of every 20 homes in America. As Kincaid told 60 Minutes in 2001, he did for art what Daniel Steele did for romance novels. These paintings may be easy to call insignificant by a critic, but they are precious to the people who bring them into their home. He was as much a painter as a brand, known for giving his scenes the warmth of light. It was art people could understand, he said. Comfort food for your wall. Everyone can identify with a fragrant garden, with the beauty of sunset, with the quiet of nature, with a warm and cozy cottage. Thomas Kincaid was only 54.